Hi, I'm Eric Lippert. I am an architect on the c -sharp Analysis team at Coverity. Uh, null dereferences are a very, very common class of, of defect, not just in c -sharp, but in other languages as well. Uh, and so we do a lot of work to try to find them. And let me describe just two techniques that we use uh, for those. Uh, the first is what we call a, a forward null, right? and that is where you, uh, you have some code path uh, on which you test some variable, let's say, to see if it's null, and you take some action if it's null. But that action is not throw an exception or return from the method or something like that. You just take some action if, uh, if the variable is null, and then you continue on your way. And then later on in that same code path, you dereference the variable as though it couldn't possibly be null. And so there's an inconsistency there. Whoever wrote the first bit of code clearly believed that the reference could be null. And whoever wrote the second piece of code, which might be the same person, uh, clearly believed that the reference could not be null. Uh, and so this tells us that there's something defective about the code. Uh, now, hopefully, uh, the problem is that the, uh, that the variable, in fact, cannot be null and that the check is unnecessary. But what is often the case in the real world is that the check is necessary, and it's necessary on both halves of the, uh, the code path, uh, and it's only on one. The second thing that we do, uh, amongst many techniques to find null dereferences, is we do statistical checks. So if you have a call to uh, a method, uh, suppose you've got 20 calls to a particular method in your program, and on 19 of those, before you dereference the return value, you check to see if the return value was null. But on the 20th, you just blithely assume that the return value is not null uh, and dereference it without checking it. That 20th is probably a defect. So we have a, a variety of uh, these sort of statistical inference techniques where we try to figure out where parts of the code don't look like other parts of the code and that possibly those are null dereference defects.